Oh, the bars are fine, you know. Everybody needs the bars. Oh, yeah, you better believe it. If it was not that, you know, everybody have, have be a lot of suicides. I tell you that much. Low bars here in Dutch Harbor, that be bad. I tell you. I love taking care of fishermen because they're funny and they're, you know, fishermen are crazy. They're insane. And I think that that's something that like bartenders have in common with them because we're pretty crazy and insane too. They're our friends, you know? We have to take care of them, they need us. You know, when you're out to sea, beating yourself up physically and mentally for weeks on end, you, you kind of want, you, it's not your, if it's not your home, you know, Dutch, you want something familiar. And I think that that's what we provide for them. Or at least that's what they tell us. <laughs> I love my job here. I love how busy we get, and I love the atmosphere and meeting all the people. We love the guys on the Deadliest Catch. The music, I mean, what better job where you can be around all these people and socialize and listen to great music. The bar? Oh, we love the bar. Everybody comes into the bar. We all meet heads and we let butt heads. We have a good night, you know? Like, and that's before you get out. I think the biggest thing that I love about living in Dutch is that Dutch is like this huge melting pot of people from all over the world. And I don't think people realize that. When they think of Dutch Harbor, they think of fishermen, they think of Alaska fishermen and Seattle fishermen, but there's this whole other community here. With the, and it's mostly because of the processing plants. They bring people from literally all over the world. It's, it's kind of like traveling all the time, just being here. So it's kind of cool. Life in Dutch Harbor. It's all hyped up. It's just a bunch of broke characters trying to get a cigarette. If you're down and out and under a bridge in Seattle, come to Dutch Harbor. It'll get you on the street and three square meals. That's if you're working at the factory. If you get on a boat, you'll last, I don't know, one trip. This is where it's at. This is where it's at. This is the real deal. I mean, it's, it, it's the weather, the environment, everything comes together in like a, a nutshell.